Oh, okay. Why am I leaning to the right? <laughs> I see that on the stream. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Hi, I'm Evil Rabbit, and we are here on Forza Motorsports 7, staring down my ESDA vet with the ESDA this weekend. Today, we are going to do a little prep, a little testing, and we're going to do a little qual mock qualifying sessions and then get into some tandems with a few of the TUS guys. Um, definitely super excited for this uh, ESDA season. Going to be uh, trying to pilot this vet here to a uh, couple, maybe some qualifying spots and uh, maybe get into some battles this year with uh, TUS backing me this year. Definitely been getting a lot of practice and uh, being a part of the team has increased my driving skill by a lot as well as increasing the rig to the Fanatec. So we are going to just hop into it. This is round one or driver search, not technically round one, is the driver search event at uh, Indy. So we're going to head into it, run some qualifying session laps ourselves and then get into some tandems and have a little mock battle and uh, have a little fun. This vet is definitely... Um, one of my favorite cars that I've ever used for ESDA so far. And uh, I went through a lot of cars getting ready to uh, figure out what chassis I was going to run this year. And came out with this one with the help of uh, some of the guys from TUS to get this thing dialed in tune. So now we're going to head into it. And uh, well, we're going to do some uh, solo uh, qualifying session. A little mock qualifying. And uh, we're already there. Good to go. Going to get the wheel cam turned on. With our proper wheel on our dash and uh we're gonna go full send and see how we can do so definitely super excited for this year's esda season even if uh i don't get a chance to qualify in you know it's still been a very um big learning curve for me going with the new wheel system tuning different cars trying to pick a new chassis from last year and uh going to a chassis that not, not many people use not many people use this uh use this vet it's one of the only vets, actually it is the only vet, that is allowed by ESDA rule for tire width and stuff. I feel like my uh, chair is a little bit closer than it should be. So I'm gonna bump that back a little bit. There we go. So the driver search event um, is this weekend, or qualifying is this weekend, and the actual event is next weekend. So we are more focused on getting our qualifying runs down more so than tandems because... Uh, we need to be able to get that those two perfect runs or near perfect runs, if possible. We will work more on tandem if we get a chance to qualify in. But like I said, we'll do some tandems later in this episode just to uh, have a little fun. So we're going to run basically some mock qualifying runs and see how this goes. Definitely been uh, getting very comfortable on this track with this car. Uh, it's Like I said, it's a bit of a learning curve with the... Uh, new wheel and stuff like that okay, that was a little bit too short don't want to cut it that short and too wide off that but we are just I don't know why it's so dark make sure we don't drop tires run the white line at the end so not the best uh, run at all but this uh, the car is uh, very well tuned for this right now um, I could tune the gear ratio a little bit if I wanted to and stay in different gear. I could probably do the course in third, but we have the uh, shifter switch in the sequential just like a dog box transmission, like uh, most of the sequential transmissions in the FD cars. So we're running it that way. That way it's quick, uh, quick changing gear. I'm already on clutch and transition through that section anyways. So we're, uh, we're pretty good to just uh, quickly bump our shifter into gear. That's a little bit better. Still a little bit earlier than I wanted to, not as wide as I wanted to here. But we're still just trying to dial this in. There may be some tweaks that I may have to make to this vet before actual qualifying. And of course I will bring you all my qual my actual qualifying runs and stuff like that as well. I am doing an early qualifying session. Um, I'm doing my qualifying on Friday, not on Saturday, because I'm busy. So I'm doing mine on Friday. So. Uh, look forward to uh, 
trying to bang those two perfect runs. So if these were my two runs, I don't think they would have been really good at all. Uh, so we're going to try and uh, get these two runs better. So if you guys are doing ESDA yourself, what uh, what cars are you guys running? Are you in the driver's search or do you have your pro license already? You know, let me know down in the comment section down below. I need to run that first turn a little bit wider than I am now. A little bit off clips. And that bump is definitely uh, something you need to be ready for. So we are allowed to drop one tire on certain sections of the course. So, you know, I think last year we weren't allowed to drop anything. But I think now we can drop one and it's just a mild deduction. But I believe two is not a complete zero. I believe it's just a massive deduction now. So it kind of makes the runs a little bit, uh, a little bit more interesting. This uh, this track with those bumps is uh, not one of the easiest tracks to run I found so far in all my in uh, courses that I've run to try and qualify. We're gonna try and run this a little wider. That's where I wanted to go. A little bit wider in midline. Cut it back in. Rumble strips are okay. That's probably a little bit shallower than I wanted to be. But overall, not too bad of a run. Like I said, still trying to get uh, more acclimated with this uh, car and the wheel. Did have to do some fine tuning to the car based on the wheel rather than uh, um, when I was on my G920. So there was some fine tweaks I had to make um, to get it to handle a little bit how I wanted it to. And I know with the new head motion, I should be running first person, but I'm so comfortable in third right now. That's why I'm going to be running uh, this round in third person too short of a time for me to want to uh, try and adapt to a new new uh, driving view before qualifying. So that's why we're running in third. So overall, I'm quite happy with how this vet is handling. Uh, are my runs perfect? No, but this is only my second year trying to compete for USDA. So, you know, I've been spending a lot more time behind the wheel of this car than I did my Camaro last year and uh, like I said with the help of the TUS guys being able to have them uh, help me out and you know have some A-class drivers to tandem with tandems are a little bit easier for me now so I was pretty good to chase driver before I'm getting a lot better now so like I said we're gonna get in some tandems here before we end this episode off try probably try one more here before we get into some tandems so I hope you guys, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of it's found in the description box below. If you guys want to keep seeing ESDA prep, let me know down in the comment section down below. That's a better run. There. I ran that one a little bit too wide. About to kick that out. So, like I said, make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter. That's two tires off. That's four tires off. <laughs> all of it's found in the description box below. I think we're going to switch it up, get online with some guys, and do some tandem runs. And, uh, well, just have a little fun, you know, shaking the bugs off this car and uh, get more acclimated to the new wheel setup. So we're going to just do some tandems and uh, see how that goes. Everyone ready? Yup. Yeah, do we look? Yep. Oh, yeah, maybe. Children doing school. Good. Fucking game. <laughs> 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 Just took the front bumper. I, I... <laughs> yeah, that was alright. Bam! Bam! <laughs> <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> you know I had to do that. Fucking shit in this. That was all me. I purposely bumped his corner to get I'm him all off center. No, no, no. no. <laughs> he and Connie were going a straight line. He's 
called it. <laughs> <laughs> Rabbit wins. Oh Fuck shit! Ow. Me, you're wasting my time in, you fag. Sorry, I had to do at least one thing. Come on. <laughs> Alright, I won't I won't touch you this time. Ooh. That's what Jimmy says. What Tom says. <laughs> What the fuck he's doing? Back again. LZ, do you know your uh, decision? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how I'm not going to fucking clear you. Are we well, one more time? I think Rango missed a clip, but Rabbit trips time. Yeah, where, 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 which clip did I miss? All of them, you uh, fucking ginger bell end. One more time. I dropped, oh, I, fr <laughs> I, I dropped the front tire on that inner clip, didn't I? Uh, yeah. yeah, you dropped one more, one tire. Yeah, yeah. One more time, innit? Yeah, it's good one more time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's all of them. <laughs> Could've got too much, Justin. Bollocks here. Oh. Oh. Mad. Fuck, I've got a black screen. Not a black screen. <coughs> oh, I didn't even know it was halfway through the world. That's your excuse. <laughs> no, I carried on drifting, I was just scratching my nose. Did you see both of them then, LZ? Huh? Did you see both of them? Then? For those. Those, those, those? Yeah, you said you had a black screen at the time it happened. Oh, yeah, only happened for a second. I'm but you can't uh, drop that anyway. Load... No. I'm gonna oh, upload this yeah. to YouTube and call it. Oh, no, you can drop one. One is a. Uh, Wait, where? Two is zero. Oh, okay. Why am I leaning to the right? <laughs> I see that on the stream. That was a good chase, though. Yeah. That was a good lead. So. It was, but I know what my decision is. <laughs> I know why. I don't have a clue, if I'm honest. No, nope, nope. I don't want to pit. Okay. Hey, you go first, Cody. Um. I'm saying rabbit wins on. For one reason. Is I'm it because it's me? No. <laughs> That's half of the reason. In the first, when rabbit did a lead, you both dropped a tire. Okay. But on that one, you dropped a tire. Rabbit didn't. Where was I didn't see it. It was as you were coming back to the straight line again. It was your back right tire. I... Is it where it's a white line? No, you were on the grass. Very slightly. I saw the mud instead of the smoke. Okay. I didn't see Rangan drop a tire on the follow. It was no, it was on the lead. It was on his lead. I said a rabbit. He dropped one on the lead. Where? At the end? Yeah. 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 On the grass. On on rabbit lead, they both dropped the tire. Yeah. We can just uh, one more yeah, time. That's what I'm saying. I mean, yeah. I don't mind. Screw it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one more time. Okay. <laughs> Hold on, what are my tires at? Oh, it doesn't matter, I can't change tires. Alright, let's go. Do this up one more time. Thief said sucky sucky five dollar. Do an inky for sure, Mouse done. Oh shit! Well, there's my big mistake. It's hey, alright. You uh, you slowed down, but it wasn't like a drastic amount, so I made a mistake behind you. Wasn't quite a straight, but it was like a massive loss of. It wasn't far off, yeah. 
I don't know if that would have been a zero or if that would have been a massive deduction. I'd say deduction because you weren't entirely straight for yours. But then there was two times. Oh, I followed you all the is way out two? there. Is that two? Yeah, that was two because I followed you out there. Oh. I could feel the vibration, but I was like, that might just be one. I need to stay off the rumble strips. One more time. <laughs> Alright, I need tires. My tires are yellow. Oh, are you allowed to change tires? <laughs> yeah, go for tires. Go for tires. Yeah, are you yeah, allowed to? Right. I, thought... Yeah. I thought whoever zeroes first. Um, it is, like, but we'll get zero one more time. First. All right, that's fine. So, uh, you. Did you say I suck or I'm second? I thought I heard I suck. Second, both. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this picture is uploading on Instagram. I can't switch to anything because this picture won't so upload. Ooh. I think you might have me, unless you make a mistake, because I overshot my entry. That's nasty, because I just got a really good run. Because I, uh, I, I overshot... Or not. I overshot my entry because I uh, fell behind on the start, so I kind of had to play catch-up, and I was too much faster than I should have been. Yeah, let me just uh, switch back to... Got that Ranga fab. Oh fuck, I've stalled. <laughs> oh, that's probably why I launched in third. <laughs> Instagram was like being stupid today. I think that one has to go to Ringer. <laughs> Dropped one on follow inside corner, coming to the second arc clip. But I'm not a judge. Oh. Yeah, I think we're in the one. Yeah, I'm gonna give it. You know what? I, I don't feel bad losing after going a couple more times. GG, sir. GG.